Let's talk about all the supplies you need to achieve the level blonde that you want. So, first off, you're definitely going to need a pair of gloves. <laughs> you're dealing with some toxic chemicals here. You definitely want to protect your skin. Use whatever kind of gloves work for you, latex, non-latex, whatever works best. But I highly recommend you always wear a pair of gloves when you're going to be bleaching your hair. The next thing that's really super duper important is you need a plastic tint bowl. This one you can get at any beauty supply store. A plastic tint bowl. Do not use metal. Do not use metal with these chemicals. It can have an adverse reaction. It can cause the chemicals to process too fast and then the processing power is all worked out before you've even put on your hair. So don't do it. Has to be plastic. Can't say that enough. The next thing, again, I'm going to talk about skin protectant again later in the video or in this in this course. Petroleum jelly or some type of skin protectant, also very important. This is something people often overlook. And if you're watching me right now, you're probably bleaching your hair for the first time, and you're, you're you might experience some sensitivity to the chemicals. So I highly recommend that you get some petroleum jelly or some type of skin protectant. Definitely need that. Then the next thing you need, oh, you need a little measuring cup. It needs to be able to measure out at least two ounces. So you want a measuring cup that is able to measure out at least two ounces, two ounces or about 60 milliliters. Two ounces or about 60 milliliters. So you need that. The next thing you need is you need the tint brush. Yes, I highly recommend using one of these. It just these do a really good job of really getting in between the hair shafts and really getting down to the scalp and you need to make sure you use this to really get in the nooks and crannies around the ears. I mean, use use a tint brush. Definitely use a tint brush. Okay. You only actually need two chemicals just to start the bleaching process. So it's actually quite simple. First off, you need powder bleach powder bleach this is my favorite bleach this one is L'Oreal Super Oreal Blanc professional powder bleach and it lifts up to seven levels so in other words if your hair is black this will get you to blonde this will get you to blonde this is the one I've been using for years years and years and years it's my favorite I've tried others I know a lot of people seem to like quick blue there's a lot of different powders out there. Some of them are purple. Some of the powders are blue. This powder is white. Experiment a little bit and see which one you like. But honestly, I recommend once you pick one, always use that one consistently. So we'll talk about that in another video. Okay, and then you need cream developer. So we'll talk about this more too. But I'll talk about it in a separate video. But you need cream developer. So this one, again, this is L'Oreal. This is their Oreo cream, and I use volume 40. And I'll tell you why in another video. Okay, the last two things you need, you need what they call purple shampoo and purple conditioner. I highly recommend you also get the corresponding conditioner. I'm going to recommend two here. You only need one of the two. So my favorite is one and only Shiny Silver Ultra conditioning shampoo. The brand is one and only shiny silver ultra conditioning shampoo and you can see it's very well loved. It's very purple. This one's my favorite. This is the one that really gets you to like platinum or super white. So you want that and they have the corresponding conditioner which you could again you can see is well loved by me. But shiny silver by one and only and my second favorite, and this one you may have heard of, and this one's pretty popular, commonly used, is Shimmer Lights. Shimmer Lights Shampoo Blonde and Silver. So get the shampoo and get the corresponding conditioner. So that's all that you need to go blonde. And as we go on in the series, I'm going to describe each item, why you need these items, and which one's the right one for you. And that's it for this video. I'll see you in the next one.